Hello everyone, this is Izukaze Phoenix, and this is a short little video of a proof of concept, as I said earlier. This is me, level 60 warrior, around item level 190, going against the Relic of Born Chimera, which is a level 58 man uh, trial boss. Generally put, you really can't try this at level or even two or three or four levels above. Because, honestly, as a warrior, you need equilibrium. Equilibrium having a base 1200 cure potency, and you'll see me use it quite liberally when I uh, get low on health. Ah man, crit fell cleaves always feel so good. So the general strategy I had for this is start off in defiance, throw down all the damage I can, when my health starts to get about 60 to 50%, switch back, no, no, deliverance, not in deliverance, wow, I'm a warrior and I don't know my skills, what's with me, start in deliverance, Toss down all the damage I can, and I get down to about 50 or so percent, pop back into Defiance, and just abuse the heck out of Second Wind and Equilibrium, as well as throwing down Twin Inner Beasts. Since Inner Beast, as some would know, gives you a damage uh, reduction, well, you take less damage, not you do less damage. <sighs> Words. At around 75-ish percent, the Doran Chimera stops giving tells for the Ram's Breath and the Dragon's Breath. Not all the time, but still. Not that it matters, because considering how much I overlevel this and my item level, I'm just better off standing in the AoEs and healing with Equilibrium and Second Wind. And that, and here is the major problem. Paralysis. He loves throwing out paralysis. Unfortunately, since I don't have anything like the Warden's Pain on the Warrior that could get rid of uh, status effects and block the next one, I have to just grin and bear and deal with it. Doesn't make it any less annoying. Hey look, it's the Chimera's useless move! Yeah, Dragon's voice hits everywhere around it except the area right next to it. Guess where I am 100% of the time.
I should have said something about this earlier, but the Ram's voice at the beginning of the match only hits in the area around it. Later on, like as we is now, it pretty much affects everything. Kind of annoying, so keep a watch out for that if you're actually doing the synced. The battle is winding down to a close, and this actually isn't the first time I've done this. I've done this at least two times before. One victory, one defeat. Victory was the very first time I did this. Defeat was the second time, and uh, it happened at around this juncture here. Yeah, just because it's on low health me, don't just forego surviving and try to kill it. Please don't. And with another pair of fell cleaves incoming, 5k, 5.5k, and down goes the big bad chimera. Thank you all for watching this, and uh, enjoy the rest of your day or evening or whatever. I don't know what time it is in your part of the world. Whoa, hold on a moment. I still gotta show you that mess up I did. Oh, <laughs> oh,